Hi everybody, today I'm making a stir fry and this will be lunch and dinner. So I already made my white rice. So what I'm gonna do is put this white rice in this bowl. As you can see, I just made it. Okay, so now dump it in here and this is how I make my stir fry and I also do like a um, I do different types I do some with egg peas and carrots that comes out really good but I'll have to do that in a different video because I don't want to use my eggs up right now eggs are so expensive so let me finish getting the rest of this rice off. Now everything I'm using to make the stir fry is all from Dollar Tree. So what I'm using is I use this long grain rice. This is a two pound bag you can get there for um, $1.25 which is a great deal for two pounds. So this is what I'm making my stir fry with. I like to make my stir fries with the Calrose rice. It just lasts longer, especially in the fridge, so I really like that. But um, this works okay with the long grain. Okay, so everything's from Dollar Tree. So I even used the garlic from Dollar Tree. The vegetables I used in my stir fry. I mixed California blend and the stir fry blend. And um, the only thing I didn't get from there is the ground beef. I got the ground beef on a great deal uh, probably almost a month ago, and I froze it in different bags. And um, I found the ground beef this morning and I was like, oh, I forgot about that. So I thought, I'm going to make stir fry. So I have the soy sauce I got at Grocery Outlet. These are only 50 cents a bottle, 5.1 ounce, and it's a Heinz. And I thought, you know what, I'm going to get it for 50 cents. So I got a couple bottles. So what I'm going to do is there's two openings here, and this controls the pour. So I'm going to keep my finger right here on the back because I don't want too much to pour out at one time. I just use a little bit. You control it with this, otherwise it'll just keep pouring straight out. Okay, so then what I'm gonna do, I just use a little bit of soy sauce. You can see I don't use a lot. And it's just to give it the flavor. And I use a fork so I can kind of fluff it up. So that is in there. And then I'll add a little bit of salt and pepper. And let me see, I forgot to grab that. So let me grab that right now. So here is my salt and pepper. And then I just add a little bit of this raven salt. I really like this stuff. This is locally made and it's so good. Just put a little bit of that. Not too much because that soy sauce gives it a lot of salt. So that's it on flavoring what I do in my rice. So okay, so I made this stir fry here and I'm just going to pour it all in there. It's got the ground beef and the vegetables from the Dollar Tree, their frozen vegetables. So I got all those in there and I'm just gonna stir this up. And I do have two wooden uh, spoons and usually I'll just, um, you know, go like this with both spoons to mix it up. But since I only have one hand filming, I'm just gonna use my fork. And the fork keeps that rice fluffed up. So I think that is good. So this is going to be lunch or dinner. And this is a lot. You can see this made a lot. I made, I cooked up one cup of rice. I always cook up one cup of rice at a time. Um, because I usually let it last through the week. 
so you can see that this made a good sized bowl um but i can just eat this like this this is going to be my meal for lunch and dinner and it's so tasty this way and all i did it was use um dollar tree this is a dollar 25 and they have these in the frozen section i use their dollar 25 rice for two pounds and to mix minced garlic when i fried up the meat and there's just a couple pieces left of vegetables so i'm gonna drop that in there okay and i think that looks great so this is how you can make a quick stir fry at home and um you can use any vegetables you want or any meat you want you can use ground sausage or even um slice up some sausage that makes really good and um you can also do peas carrots egg uh i've seen people use spam it's really good with spam if you can believe it you can chop it up real small so i'll do different different um stir fry videos to show you different ways you can make it but this is the easiest way to make a quick meal and it is so hearty and it is so filling so you might want to try this out you just boil your rice once it's done put it in here mix your soy sauce with it just a few drops you don't need a lot and that's it so okay everybody this is stir fry for lunch and dinner thank you for watching